All right, Catherine, thank you. Back here with DDP. We talked about DDP yoga a little bit earlier, but what, what is it? It's not the chanting, it's not the, put it this way, as your t-shirt says, it ain't your mama's yoga, okay? <laughs> it ain't your mama's yoga. How, how did you come up with this and explain exactly what it is? Well, I didn't start wrestling until I was 35. My career Which is when most guys are retiring. <laughs> Stone Cold Steve Austin retired at 37. Yeah. Edge retired at 38. I, my career didn't take off till I was 40. So I was constantly looking for ways to hold back the hands of time. But yoga was not one of them. Uh, my career took off in 96. I was 40. 97, 98, I was on top of the world. Then I blew my back out so badly that this is all the flexibility that I had. And I literally had to push myself back up. I talked to three of the best specialists in the world for back spine, you know, yeah. the, whole, the whole deal. And uh, they all said I was done. Now, I'm a guy who wouldn't be caught dead doing yoga the first 42 years of my life, but I was desperate. I signed a multi-million dollar deal and my career was gonna be over. So I gave it a shot. In, in less than three weeks, I was amazed by how much flexibility and core strength immediately mm -hmm. I started to get. So I started to mix it with rehab. So I took those yoga positions and mixed them with rehab mm -hmm. positions. Then I threw in old school calisthenics. And then I threw in what makes DDP yoga its own Is this you're doing, you've got yoga poses, but you're doing squats, you're doing push-ups, you're doing all the other things that help build you in other ways, get your heart rate up and gives you just a, a tremendous workout. And that's where the last thing is dynamic resistance. And think of isometrics meets isokinetics, which is isometrics moving. I call it dynamic resistance. And that's the demonstration I wanted to show you. All right, today. well, let's, uh, let's uh, get, do a little... At here. your home, it's really simple. I want you to try it with me and Gene. All I want you to do is put your thumb and index fingers together like this. But don't do this. Open your fingers. It's a diamond cutter. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Would you ever believe that? Could you keep <laughs> going like this, right? I want you to push really hard now, really hard. Now, when you push it hard, you, think, you don't want to be able, don't let me do that. Oh, okay. Push hard. Yeah, you get it. Now, your forearms, your bicep, and your pectoral muscles all have to engage. And it's all about engaging muscles. shaking a little bit, right. is that all right? Now straighten your arms out in front of you. Now I want you to pull your pinky away from your thumb. Now your hand, like really pull it. Now your hand, your forearm, your tricep, your delta, and your trap have to engage. Now keep pulling, but don't just lift your arms to the heavens so the universe smiles back at you. <laughs> Create resistance as you move. Now when you get back as far as you can comfortably, bring your arms out to the sign of a cross or a T. Clinch your fist tight, bring your fist together, biceps together. In other words, mm. hulk it up, brother. That's right. <laughs> Open your fingers wide. Tension. Shoulders back, chest out. At ease. Now tell me that you're not. got a little perspiration <laughs> working, I gotta tell you. <laughs> and, and the reason why that is. But that's good. I mean, that doesn't mean I'm not in shape, it's just it's, it's working. Well, here's exactly what happens. Every time you flex or engage a muscle, your heart has to beat faster to get the blood to the muscle. So this is why DDP yoga is kick-ass cardio and will dramatically increase your flexibility and strengthen your core like never before. With minimal but you don't need to get on the treadmill to get that heart rate up. Exactly. You do it right here. And now we were talking earlier about you taking the time off. Yeah, I right? did. I did. Your back. This, yep. this will this will heal your body. That's at least it did for me and the disabled veteran. It makes you more flexible. There's no no question about it. So, so. Where, where where are you Cole? Where are you to, like where were you when you stopped? When you, when you stopped Probably right? right. If I was here, I was lucky. Right. All right so, so now and I'm, I'm not really warmed up, but I can get down to here. But your arms hang. Good, though you're on your toes there. Yeah. So I can't do what you can do, though. Flexibility <laughs> is youth. I showed you where I was when I blew my back out. Now, this is, you know, I've been on the road. I flew all the way from Mexico yesterday. This is my flexibility. <sighs> Cold. But flexibility and core strength is a whole nother animal. And I talk about taking your core strength to a different level. So what I'm going to do is focus <sighs> on you at home with these squishy sneakers. And at six foot four, 224 pounds, take my foot over my head and have a conversation with you. At how old? 57 years young. <laughs> this is what DDP yoga is all about. It helps you hold back the hands of time. If you're an athlete, it'll take you to another level. Go to ddpyoga.com to get all the information. And you can catch me in Dover, New Hampshire. Yeah. I'll be at Seacoast Kettlebell. Kettlebell. Right. Go up there tomorrow, check them out. Uh, go to the website, you'll find more information there. Should we leave them with a little feel the bang? That's right, push those thumbs and index fingers together and feel the uh, bang, bang, monkeys. <laughs> We're gonna take a break, we'll be right back. Awesome, man, thanks, bro. Appreciate it. <laughs>